Hi, my name is Rachel McCulloch, and I am here at the 17th Annual Casterton Lecture. The post-lecture reception is just wrapping up now, and today we heard from Marty Barron, whose work with the Washington Post um, and its investigation of the sex abuse scandal in the Catholic Church has won a Pulitzer Prize and also inspired the movie Spotlight. And today, Barron talks about everything from the future of journalism to being played by Keith Scriver in the movie, and um, this is a clip from the question and answer period. Spotlight movie with a bunch of other journalism students, or I'm a fourth year journalism student as well. Um, and it was empowering, like Alan Thompson had said. Um, so I think a lot of journalists when watching that had similar reactions. I'm wondering if you think that the movie in any way romanticized journalism or investigative journalism or those hardships, <laughs> and whether that's necessarily a good or a bad thing that it's true. Uh, well, I have a good friend of mine who's a journalist who said that he, I asked him whether his kids had seen the movie, uh, they're at college age or just out of college, and he said, no, and I, I don't want them to see the movie. And I said, well, why not? He said, I'm afraid they might want to become journalists. <laughs> <laughs> so, um, uh, as far as uh, romanticizing investigations, I actually don't think it romanticizes investigations. Shows that it's really hard work, and I think that's one of the strengths of the movie. It's not like some source whispers in your ear or anything like that, and, and all of a sudden, you know, it's just a leak or something like that. It's just a lot of hard work. You're sitting there going through documents, you're sitting there going through directories. It takes a long time. You have to go to people's homes, knock on their doors, intrude on their lives, and have them slam the doors in your face. It happens a lot. And you got to go to court, you got to talk to, you try to get, you know, documents in court. Uh, they can be difficult to find. People may have put them under seal, or they kept them, let's say it's a government agency, they won't release it. You may have to file a FOIA in that instance. Uh, it's just really difficult work. And I think one of the things that you know, the critics have said in looking at the movie is that it accurately and authentically portrays what investigative reporting is all about.